Alright, yes. Today we're going to do a Hot Wheels haul. No racing or anything today. But I want to show you this strange Hot Wheels haul. You guys tell me how this could have happened. I might be making too much of it, but it's pretty cool. So I went to Hot Wheels. This is about a week ago now. And I had these kind of stored in the back. but um, So I could separate it from the rest of the Hot Wheels so I can show you the strange Hot Wheels haul. So, at the time, there was nothing almost on the pegs. Absolutely nothing. I'm new to Hot Wheels, so I was like, let's, you know, there's certain cars I want. I don't want every car out there. I want cars with kind of movies or or movie cars or um, cars that my parents drove or my grandparents drove in the past. And I'm looking for those cars with some kind of personal story connection with me. But, I, well, I, I was like, oh, there's nothing here. They haven't restocked or anything. But there was a couple cars hanging on the pegs that I've never seen before. And, of course, here's a new one. This is, some of these are new, some of these are old, but I'll, I'll get to the strange one here. The Roadster, that's pretty cool. I like that car. Hot Wheels Roadster. Okay. Here's one of the stranger cars. Like, I've never seen that hanging there before. 99 Ford Mustang. And so I look on the back. And I'm like, okay, that's a 2014 car. And mostly I've seen 2015 cars at the um, store. So I was like, okay, that's kind of weird. And there's two, three places in my Walmart where the cards are hanging at. There's a little rip right there. But it's okay. So I was like, okay, that's cool. And then I look at this one. I'm like, why is this card so beat up? That's a big tear across there. I'm like, oh, that's cool, though. I like these older cars. 68, you know... Chevy Nova. I've never seen that there before, and so I flip it over. New. Look for 2011 vehicles. Where did this come from? How did this get on the pegs? I mean, unless they pull it out of the back somewhere. But this has been sitting around since 2011. Unlike action figures, I wonder if someone returned it to get some new cars or something. But hey, that's fine with me. If they return it, that's fine. I thought, like, wow, that's a cool car. 2011. Emailing off. And then, got another car here. 68 Blymouth, Blymouth, Plymouth Barracuda Formula S. You know, I'm never going to be a rich man. And there's this is the only way I can afford, and close enough, I can get a car like this. You know, I'm not going to go, I'm not going to go buy a, a real 68 Plymouth. For one, my, for one, my wife would kill me. And this is from 2014. My grandpa had a car similar to this, but in the 80s, but it was a Dodge, but, um, it was a big old hoopty car, though, but it wasn't quite, this color, the same color, but it wasn't this style, so this kind of reminds me of my grandpa's car. <laughs> That's one reason I got that one. Here's a cool one. 72 Grand Torino Sport. It's like, okay, I've never seen that there. This is from 2014. So it's weird, they got this bunch of 2014 cars just laying around, and a 2011 car. 74 Greenwood Corvette. That is a pretty cool looking car. I'm gonna have to look up that car. Why it looks? Why is it called Greenwood? And why are their lights like that? So pretty neat. 2014. Only one. There's only one of each there too. New for 2013, and it was hanging on the pegs. 68 Plymouth Barracuda, which is a really nice orange. I like that. Pretty neat. I like it. I like it a lot. A lot of the 60s cars. Big old hoopties. This is a new one for this year. I do like that. That just looks cool. I mean, if he painted that black, that would almost look like the Batmobile. Which would be a cool Batmobile. We'll definitely have to race that. GT Hunter. That's cool. I see that now at the stores a lot. Okay, this car was kind of beat up. I'm like, okay, what is this? Corvette Grand Sport. Showroom 2013. So, were these in the back, like I said? You know, hiding, but there was only one of each? Or did somebody just return them to get new cars? I don't know. Here's a cool car. This is from last year, too. 74 Brazil a Brazilian Dodge Charger. My grandma had a 70 Dodge Charger when I was growing up. It's probably the closest I'll get in Hot Wheels form. They're just like that, too. Her car did. It was red. Red like this. 
No pinstriping though. Uh, well, a couple more. 2011 car hanging on the pegs. 68 Copo Camaro. Man, that is cool. There used to be a, I don't want, maybe a color one. There used to be a car just like this in real life going around town when I was in high school. Man, it was loud and fast. Just don't see these 68 Camaros going around. See the Mustangs. Don't see the Camaros. And... Two more to go. I think this is... Nope, this is not new. 2014. Another 2014. And, um... Where's the recap? Oh, yeah. Stingray. Kind of beat up. I have a blue one of that, but I like the silver. We'll have to race that. And last but not least... Ah, that's cool. 2010... Shelby GT Super Snake. Sharp looking car. Man, I would love to have that car in real life. Bubbles all beat up too. 2013 showroom. So, weird how these cars just appeared on the pegs at my store. So, I'm not complaining. Especially with that Camaro. I'm going to open these eventually. Race them. But that's my haul, guys. My weird Hot Wheels haul. Some new, some really old. I think this one still surprises me the most. 2011. So. Alright guys, thanks for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe. Check my link down below. New race coming up. If you guys are interested. It will be the Batmobile race. Alright. Which Batmobile's the fastest? All right, guys. See you later. Bye. Ah! I'm so sick of your face. What else can I do? I'm so sick of your face. The ugly keeps pouring. The ugly keeps pouring. The ugly keeps pouring. Ha, 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 ha.